of showing you this when I first pulled it out of the ground. Uh, this is a weed, but closer look. Look at the soil around it. Look at the leaf up here on the top. Look at the soil, how it clumps and is in like little cottage cheese um, texture. Look at it. And look at the, the, the roots. See how clean the roots are? See how healthy they are? Nice and white and reddish in color. This is what my plants are experiencing in my soil. Um, and I also use a method which is called chop uh, and drop. I, I cut down my weeds and I just leave them uh, on the ground so that they will re put the fertilizer back into the soil. And this is what this is. This is what my soil is. And it, if it wasn't for learning about wood chips from Mr. Paul Goucher, uh, Gauchy, I hope I'm correctly uh, pronunciating that, um, I would not be experiencing this kind of growth. Everything is growing. This is right next to, uh, where I found it, right next to a raspberry plant here. And it is the first year that this has been put in the ground. Uh, it is healthy. Only thing I don't like about this raspberry plant is these thorns. Uh, I discovered that after I started growing it. They don't mention that on the box to a packaging. But it's called a brandy wine. And uh, I thought I'd try it because I have four uh, different varieties here of raspberries. And these right here are full of berries. And the soil I'm stepping in is so soft. It, it's full of leaves and um, composted uh, wood chips. Folks, concentrate on the soil. That's it. This is a weed right here. This is a weed. If I pull it up, it'll come right up, and, and roots and all will come with it. It will not break off. Watch this. See? Most weeds will break off. This one here, look at the, look how white and healthy the roots are. Look at that. Look at the soil around the, uh, the, the, the roots, which is uh, like a cottage cheese texture. That means that it has the proper glues, has the proper uh, texture, and, and oh, the physical aspects of the soil is absolutely incredible. Look at those roots. And the roots, if you can't grow roots, you won't grow great looking plants. Now look at that. Now my roots, been in the past years, used to be smaller than, much smaller than this, one third of this, and then they would just be dark, brownish roots. And then I take the plant and I just drop it, so it'll die. This is the morning garden.